Nick? Nick? <laughs> that's good just ignore him when he's there's no reward from mugging you <laughs> he, he went in but she didn't yeah and I mean I was working with him a little bit more on that whereas maybe with her because she, it's not a problem with her yeah. she's too busy chasing away yeah but I didn't want to reward her for doing that so. yeah we'll work we can work on that too and they may have, that might, that's plenty of time, but I'm just trying to get a little bit more video of the first, first time here. They're just learning what the clicker means. And if possible, it'll eventually be good to have them separated because you can't give the treats quite fast enough for both of them. And you want to give a treat after every clicker. That's good. You just ignore them. Good, and you're re rewarding him for keeping his nose on that side. Good, excellent. See, he excellent. That was perfect. The minute his nose went over, you clicked, and that's what we were working on with him. It just takes some patience sometimes in the beginning. Excellent. Your timing is really good because the second their noses are on that other side. You're given a reward, and for right now, that's great. <laughs> Good. I'm just wait him out. Good. <laughs> And see, he's getting used to you doing it, because I was doing it with him. Now he's figuring out, oh, does she play this game too? <laughs> Good. <laughs> and the clicking of both of them might be a little confusing, because they're both going to, but, you know, we'll work on that. This is just a, let's see how they respond. Or what you can do now is wait till they both have their heads on that other side, and nobody gets anything, but that's good with him. And then once you click, you give the treat, even if he puts his head back over, that's all right. You want the clicker to always predict that the treat is coming. Good. Okay. 